we are we are on Shibai Shu this week again. Uh, this is our uh, seventh or eighth, no, a ninth class. We have two more for this uh, quarter. Um, <clears throat> so Chibai Shu is a, a series of uh, call and uh, willow is the subject matter. Um, it, if you look at the the handouts I, I emailed you or the the, uh, the blog article I uh, modified yesterday, you'll see a series of three uh, three paintings did, uh, he did in a period uh, from 1920s to the 50s. So from his uh, uh, early 70s to late uh, 90s years old. Uh, so, so his style is evolving uh, from uh, a more realistic uh, approach. But at first, he, he was pretty abstract to, to, to begin with. But uh, he became more simplified, I think, um, during, the, during the period. Uh, so it needs to refine a uh, idea over and over again. Uh, so it's like uh, practice music. Uh, you develop the voice, the personal, uh, the, uh, we call it nine quality in painting. But uh, to make an analogy, it's like uh, the singer practice their voice. Um, so the, the story uh, is well known already when you go to an uh, opera. So do you... You would, you know, the audience uh, uh, is trained to appreciate the voice, the quality of the this, the, the sound, right? So um, this is the, you know, the characteristic of this media. So if you um, attempt to make a, a perfect painting in one day or one week, even <laughs> it's not uh, very possible. But um, let me share some, you know, some approach that he used to teach his uh, uh, student. Um, and he does allow his uh, students to trace his painting. And the way to trace that is not like a, a duplicate, you know. He, he would, um, let, me, let me try to illustrate that. So I, I'll just use some cheap paper here. So if we if we if we um, draw those uh, stroke uh, guide stroke guide, uh, he, he will use a brush to to draw this template, not not pencil. So uh, I mean, we can just use uh, any small brush or a, a brush with a sharp tip. Um, and you can you can try to draw this yourself. Do you want to come closer to me? Because uh, I, I I will do it on the table. So um, let's just do the stroke uh, order. You know the so he will do a heart shape in two strokes, right? Something like that. So, um, and we just call two. And then, um, so let's repeat this. So, but you have to do this in, in one stroke. But on his uh, template, he will draw something like this. And then he will mark, uh, you know, the, the legs, maybe something like that. Um, his uh, cowboy, so he will know exactly the the um, length, the proportion, maybe uh, also the the joints. Or, or, but uh, it's abstract, and I think he 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 may make this uh, part of the, the the hip, the top. Yeah, but basically there are two, just two um, bar kind of shape um, sticks or what do you call it. So this is. A, two, three, four uh, strokes. <clears throat> and then uh, he will use dark. Use some ink here. Oh, 
Oh, before I, I change to, to the dark, there's another mysterious uh, stroke. Uh, let me just do that one. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is the, the heart shape and the, the legs. I'm not sure where the tent turns out. It should be not, not like a perfect straight, but you can look at the, the de details on the painting. Maybe there's a little angle, but not right now, we just uh, concentrate on the order. Okay, so uh, this one, it could be either on the left or right, you, you add. Uh, uh, also, the, the, it could be different in angle. So this, this part really shows the um, difference. It, it does make a difference if you paint it too low or too high, won't work. So this part, uh, although it's not very important, it's uh, it looks like an extra stroke, uh, a mistake could be, uh, but it is not. It is the, the nose of this, uh, indicate the direction of the, the head. So the, the, the cow is looking back, right? And then you, you use uh, dark to draw just like, uh, like this. And another important um, stroke, I think this whole, uh, whole part, you know, the, the perspective, whole perspective is about this, this S-shaped tail. It has direction, uh -huh. it indicates the wind uh, direction, <laughs> it echoes with the, the branches, okay? Mm -hmm. So that, that's, that, that's very important um, design. So th this, this, S and this uh, this S, but not too much S, I think, to make it uh, work. So the willow has um, this four stro four strokes, basically similar to um, the the egg crop, mm -hmm. you know, the, the egg crop. So you you do three in one direction, maybe, and another one in, in a different direction. So, and then you add, you just make it longer, you know. So that's the, uh, that's the secret, I think. Is that, is that easier? <laughs> easier? Okay, now uh, let's do it, okay. So I'm using the, uh, the uh, Ansize shrine. The, the, the first draft was done on, on the Japanese paper, Daiso paper. Uh, can, can you can you monitor that? Is it it's okay to mm -hmm. show? Okay, good. So I'm going to use uh, I keep this brush for darks. Okay, I use two brushes. So you don't have to wash, and you can use a large or just a basic soft brush. I think. And uh, in composition, if I copy this one, uh, I can do this freely. Okay, these lines mm -hmm. you cannot really duplicate. This is like a signature, you know, uh, you mm -hmm. cannot do that. So, but it, uh, it does have the, you know, the four stroke, like here there's four, mm -hmm. so that, and do another four maybe, you know. Um, this part, uh, if you divide it in half, so this is on the right side, so this uh, will never be in the center. If it's in the center, that's uh, not his original, I think. Okay, I'm going to uh, use uh, let me just use this one. Some uh, light. Uh, I think it's uh, about five in the color tonality, but you can have a little bit of variation. Um, oops, okay. So I don't need any uh, water in the in the brush, so I fully load this, and maybe a little darker to the, f but it's not uh, black, because the, the tail will be black, otherwise it won't show, okay. I'll get some dots there, that's good. Um, so not too high, imagine the, the horizon is uh, uh, mm. very low, yeah. Mm. So that's the, the perspective, and this mm. is on this side, it's about there, okay. If you're not sure, you can put the penny uh, behind, yeah. I will do a little bit larger because this paper is a little larger. 
and do the the heart shape. Okay. So when you do the left, think about the, the right also. Otherwise, you might be too big or too small. So make the heart the top a little bit flat. Okay, and then do this heart just like that without hesitation because you already practiced on a separate paper. Um, where's my paper top? Okay. Uh, and blot it before it smear. Okay, and then do the two strokes. I think there's an angle. I do see that. And it, even there's a little joint. I can see. And just a little, a little pass. You know, this could be a you know a, a creative. So just uh, make the the call with uh, a little bit movement, very very subtle. Uh, the gravity in the falling in the between the legs. Okay, here is the gesture. And I, I think uh, each version I found online uh, in maybe 20 or 30 of them are different, this part. So this one I like is looking that way, okay? Looking the, the branches. So minimalism is just, uh, just like that, it's a shape. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, it could be a little bit hole for the nose but don't fuss with that. If, if you have that in mind, you might have just a little stuff, or you can put an extra dots, that's fine. And uh, just change the brush and do the, the horn. That also pointing, oh, I, <laughs> I think I, 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 I made it a little curvy. Mm -hmm. I tried to point it up, but that's okay. This is another version of Chibai <laughs> <laughs> Everybody signed also, you know, with his signature. That's a, a very, um, I don't know, not with everybody. It's a sh maybe show of respect. Just you know, copy everything, including his signature, and copy Chi Lai Shi. Uh, just you can wait a little bit longer, but if you use pure ink, especially with some uh, uh, this, uh, this uh, ink cake, because the ink cake has a uh, kind of a more uh, particles in it. What do you call it? It's like overnight ink. It will not. It will not smear um, yeah. as a fresh ink. Okay, and then I do this. This this like a big ear. It's not like an S. I realize it's like a big ear. Three number three. Oops, yeah. I missed it. Okay, I can't that's change good. it. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, that's the principle. You don't want to retouch it. <laughs> wow. That's it. That's um, that, that's yeah. very tempting to do. Um, yeah, it yeah, was really very hard. Okay, do I need this dish? This is the only version I've seen. Uh, maybe except the very first. It's one? confusing because you don't really know what that is if you yeah. look at it at first. Okay, so we we can omit that. It, it, it makes it makes it look like a, a the the another perspective. It's like looking down, you know. You can, make, but the, uh, if since we're using dark, so uh, let me just copy this. See, take some risk, and uh, it goes to to rock the you know the tree. So let me just. Tree is a little bit darker, but okay. Here's another thing: uh, that where the tree stands is, it should be on the same plan, so it, mm -hmm. so you don't have to draw that line. Yeah. Okay. So you just go like that, and it has to be very decisive. Just go. Okay. <coughs> and. Uh, uh, you can use a, 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 a small brush for the branches. Uh, I think I have this whisker brush, this rough whisker brush. 
that I found is the most effective one to do the uh, antennas on his uh, um, shrimp or lobster. Yeah. Okay, so and he used dark as well as this. Uh, it could be a little bit lighter than the tail. So, okay, and then just go like this. Uh, there is one right across the the body. I mm -hmm. think I will mm -hmm. do it with very dry brush. Mm -hmm. Maybe so not the first one, maybe. So get a feel of it first. Okay, this one I don't really look at my brush, just think about the the wind. Okay, it's four I think. This Fourth one goes the other direction, maybe. And then, you know, after a while, you, you will be, you're on autopilot. Okay. Just use your arm, use your, your arm to, to draw. Try. You're holding the brush very high. Oh, yeah, if you draw long, long lines. If you, you can hold yeah, lower, but uh, um, you have to, uh, you have to use your arm even more. And you can also see, um, use your middle finger to twist the brush, it will create more interesting um, effect. Let's see. And I, um, I can pull the, pull the brush. So that's basically the it's easier way. Don't push the brush like that. Ah. So that's why you have to move your arm to lead uh, the, the brush. Let's do. I, I'm counting the diff distance between each section. So it's like uh, the stuff, stuff of uh, you know the music. Uh, I, I think that at the end you have to be a little freer, otherwise um, you will show some amateurism. <laughs> okay, so let me just do some dark here. Okay, just starting you did need to be. Uh, Clear. The 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 tip on the starting is hidden. Should should be more. With a little nail head, we call it. Right? Mm. Yeah. Okay. So I count mm. this one as the, the the fourth one. But you don't have to have that. Right. It's outside the the, thing, the, the picture. Okay. Oh, this tree trunk. I think I should do the trunk a little. I mean, this line could be added later, so I don't have to make the tree trunk a bit thicker to, to fit that, that loop. Anyway, that's, uh, that's okay. <clears throat> I'm going to copy his signature. You don't have to read, but you can co just copy. This, it says 95 years old. Um, his name Bai Shu, old man, paint. Paint? Paint, yeah. Paint, painted, yeah. Painted. Okay. Yeah, his, uh, his style is like, the, hor the, the horizontal is a little bit like at angle. It's all kind of wow. like that. Oh yeah, that that one. So his signature is not very difficult to fake, huh? Mm. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not in the eyes of the expert, though. <laughs> mm -hmm. But most people, you know, will. Believe me, 
I got calls like like you said. Uh, I got cheap buy shoe from eBay, you know. Um, but it would be easy to copy. Yeah, it. yeah, and with his signature, his seal. I did have someone, you know, to duplicate the seal, which has mm -hmm. lost you know, from the the, imp the imprints. These days, you can, fix, you know, the, so many ways to to copy a seal. Okay. But I won't use his seal. I don't have the seal. This is my. Oops, sorry. To make it bigger. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, he you, usually uh, don't do, but sometimes I do see uh, mm. a horizon like a, a slope or something. So you don't uh, you don't have to. So the minimal. Um, Style is to deduct every anything necessary, you know, and use other element to suggest uh, the ground. <laughs> yeah. So you you can pick make this in the front, but um, and then in another way is overlapping. So let me just uh, use overlapping. It's kind of hard to do this. Don't try if you are not experienced. But you can make the um, you can make half. Who said you cannot? But as long as the the chi, the breath continues, you know you you mm -hmm. you, you have the option. So usually when I do this, I don't have I don't make a hard connection. Just yeah. leave a break. Mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, and continue like that. So that's uh, mm. now it's your Should your turn. That? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you. Okay. Thanks for watching. Happy painting. <laughs>